Today, January 24th, we celebrate the feast day of St. Francis de Salad, Bishop, Doctor of the Church, and the patron saint of writers in Christian unity, whose role as a priest and bishop helped bring thousands of Protestants back to the Catholic Church. Born into a noble family in France and expected to become a lawyer, St. Francis felt called to the priesthood at a young age. His father wanted him, the first of his six sons, to attend the best schools in preparation for a career as a magistrate. For this reason, Francis was sent to Padua to study law. After receiving his doctorate, he returned home and in due time told his parents he wished to enter the priesthood. His father strongly opposed Francis in this and only after much patient persuasiveness on the part of the gentle Francis did his father finally consent. Francis was ordained and elected provost of the Diocese of Geneva, then a center for the Calvinists. Francis set out to convert them. Observing his gentle disposition, patience, and conviction, the parents would often come around and entertain a conversation. Over the course of several years, St. Francis' patience and steadfast determination brought back over 40,000 back to the church. He was appointed Bishop of Geneva. A renowned and holy friendship existed between him and St. Francis de Chantal. In cooperation with her, he founded the Visitation Nuns in 1610. He instituted guidelines for clergy and became one of the first to offer organized catechetical instruction to the young and old alike. While St. Francis was in France, he suffered a stroke and he died at the age of 56. Numerous miracles have been reported by his tomb. Francis de Salis was canonized in 1665 and named the Doctor of the Church in 1877. St. Francis de Salis, pray for us.